Ser versus estar by Spanish Bay Area. Objective. To have a good understanding of how verbs ser and estar to be are used. Note the different meanings in these two sentences. The apple is green, meaning the apple is not ripe. And the apple is green, meaning the color of the apple is green. The first sentence expresses the temporary condition of the apple. How is the apple? It is unripe. The second sentence expresses the permanent condition of the apple. What color is the apple? It is green. In Spanish, the verb to be has two different forms depending on whether the speaker wants to express the temporary or the permanent condition of the apple. La manzana está verde. The apple is unripe. La manzana es verde. The apple is green in color. In general, you serve to express who someone is. Él es José. He is José. What someone is. José es maestro. José is a teacher. To say where someone is from. Pedro es de Perú. Pedro is from Peru. How someone is always. Pedro es inteligente. Pedro is intelligent. To tell the time, even though it is constantly changing. Es la una. It is one o'clock. To say where and when an event is taking place. El concierto es mañana. The concert is tomorrow. El concierto es en el San Jose Arena. The concert is in the San Jose Arena. Use a star to express how someone is at the moment. Pedro está enfermo. Pedro is sick at the moment. Where someone is located. Pedro está en la escuela. Pedro is at school. What is happening now? Present progressive. Pedro está leyendo. Pedro is reading. Now that you know the uses of ser and estar, let's conjugate both verbs. Please note these verbs are irregular. They don't follow the conjugation patterns you have learned so far, and so they must be memorized. Conjugation of ser. Yo soy. I am. Tú eres. You are. Él, ella, usted es. He, she, you is. Nosotros somos. We are. Ellos, ellas, ustedes son. They, you all are. Conjugating estar. Yo estoy. I am. Tú estás. You are. Él, ella, usted está. He, she, you is. In a formal way. Nosotros estamos, we are. Ellos, ellas, ustedes están. They or you all are. Now that you know the uses of ser and estar, do the worksheet related to this video. Keep homework and present it to teacher when class resumes. Keep your notes related to this video. Your instructor will check your notes and review your worksheet. Your instructor will count your notes as one quiz grade. This is very important.